video is sponsored by STS Footwear. Footwear of the fans, by the fans, for the fans. Get your own Gator sneakers at stsfootwear.com and use the code GTFANS for $15 off at checkout. You know, social media where everybody wants to elf, you know, for homecoming. And um, it's not something that you can just change over immediately. Uh, just like this past year, we had had four games in five weeks and had painted the Gator head four times. And like I said, we double coat the orange and the white every time. So that's eight coats of paint within five weeks. And, uh, you know, I saw some comments that, why don't you just take some green over and cover it up? And it's, it's not just the color of it, it's also the, the texture, the leaf texture of the grass, because that many games in, the grass is really thinning and uh, it's starting to get, be more of a mat of the of paint, you know, and just not straight leaf blades that we're painting. So. Uh, just coming in and putting green over it doesn't work. We've, we've had that experience, uh, you know, with lacrosse a few years ago. We hosted all of our season home games, and then uh, right after our home season, we had conference championship that they wanted that logo out at, at center field. So we had painted the Gator head all season. We had one week to change over to uh, the conference logo at center field. And then the following week, we were hosting uh, postseason so then we had to change from conference to NCAA and we were greening it you know like everybody suggested but it's just it just doesn't look good I mean it's it was a necessity then because of uh, logos for for conferences and uh, but it's just not as simple as going out with green and, and covering it up.